betray you. How could I? I will cast this spell. It will give you power. Immortality. Anantha, my love, I would die for you. I'm not an orphan. I await your arrival. Grandpa. Mama, I can't wait to meet Nana and Papa. Sophie! Yeah. Be careful. No! For centuries, I have waited. I witnessed everything. That's him, Dakota, the curse of these isles. A monster. He takes to the skies on his flying buffalo whenever there's a full moon. According to the scriptures, he's immortal. Don't worry, ma'am. I will do what I can for your husband. I know some herbal remedies that can cure him. First, I'll take him to the mansion. Give me a hand. Seriously. Oh, anyway, there's no use crying over spilled milk.
doing this to us. Agent, I've lost everything because of you. Now your daughter will pay the price. Nagin, why did he call me that? So, what brings you to these parts of the Isle? I have only a faint memory about my parents, whom I lost in a fire during my childhood in India. My grandparents sent me to the United States, and I spent the rest of my childhood in the orphanage. A few weeks back, I received an invitation from my grandfather. You received an invitation from Sir Creek? That's impossible. I'm the caretaker, and my master is long dead. Show me the letter. He's dead? Hmm. I would recognize Sir Creek's handwriting any time. Looks like someone got you here purposely. This is his dark magic indeed. For centuries, Darkata has searched for the purest soul to create an elixir of life that can restore his lost bride. It seems with your daughter, he's found it. What do you mean, elixir of life? I'm not entirely sure. If only I knew the scriptures. Maybe Mupan, the shaman of the Narara Isles, knows more. Oh, great. How do I get to Narara? I think the old diesel boat at the dock still works. We're missing the boat key. Something tells me it's somewhere in my master's bedroom. I've done all I can for your husband. I will take him to the tribal doctor in the nearby village.
Hmm. Seems Mupan knows more about Dark Karta. I need to meet him somehow. Mary, my dear, I am your grandfather, Creek. You shouldn't have come here. It's too dangerous. I didn't write such a letter. The Master of Dark Arts must have written it. Oh well, you're here. So, I'll tell you everything I know. <laughs> 